Hey guys, so we're back again. And I'm showing you the little people by Cabbage Patch that I have. She is from 1981. And her name is Jacqueline Joy. That's what they named her. So, I say she's from 1981 because that paper right there says it. They first came out in 1978. So she's the Little People Soft Sculpture Baby. She's the Preemie 2 edition. So cute. So we're gonna take off this little outfit and put her into a vintage baby gown. She's so cute. She is so cute. Oh my gosh, she has a cloth diaper. And it's got pins. Oh my goodness. We've obviously never changed her clothes. No. Okay. I didn't really think about changing their clothes until I saw other people's We've actually had it for a little bit. Huh? Change clothes, yeah. Okay. Oh my goodness, look at her. The one thing I she's very like when you lay her down, look at her head goes back so much. I wish it was like a little more up. <laughs> but oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh wow. Those are old. Okay, well we'll keep her little cloth diaper on her. So she's got her tag right here. It's even different. Oh, she's a 1978. Okay, there we go. That tag says it all. Wow, she's super old. No offense to anyone born in 78. I'm just meaning like her ear is out there and she looks so good. Like, wow. You guys are not super old. We only talk about that when it comes to toys. You guys yes. are still so young, okay? Don't take any offense. Look at her. Amazing condition. Okay. So we're going to... I mean, <laughs> sitting her up. Everything has to be 20 years old and it's vintage already. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm already vintage. But, you know, we just call toys super old. All right? That we want them to be super old. That's something to brag about. Okay, so we're going to put on a vintage <laughs> Carter sleeper. It's probably from the 70s as well. Seems like these ones are. It's got the string. And look at it. It's got little bunnies there. It says, I love carrots. And they're just doing different things. So I thought this would work for her. All right, let's get this on her little head. I wish I had a little hat for her. I don't think I have a little hat, but I thought that would be so cute. Like a little preemie hospital hat? I yeah, um, because Henry looked so good. So this one's name is Jacqueline. I think that's kind of, I don't think the name is fitting for her to be honest. So I think <laughs> we may end up, we're gonna change her name. Because Jackie doesn't even like Jacqueline. Um, but yeah, we'll end up changing her name. So you guys can like suggest names for her if you'd like. Um, I would say leave them in the comment area so I can see them. Because the chat, it's kind of, you know, well, it's in the chat. Oh my gosh, there we go. I need some little preemie, little preemie gown for her too. It'd be cute. But I thought this vintage one would be so perfect. And we do have a headband oh, look. at the very least. Oh, a hospital hat. That's perfect. Yay, because she's a preemie. It's, but it's big for her head. Oh, is it? No, it's okay, though. They'll, they'll be big for her head. She's got a little... Aww. She has a really little she head. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the hats are better That's on so your cute. brother. Oh, but look at gosh, her. Oh, my it. gosh. We need to figure her out a name. Look at you. You're so sweet. So, yeah. So, now we have two in the collection. The, aw, there he is. He's taking care of his little sister. Even though she's older. He's old. She's much older than him. But he's going to take care of her. Ah, they're adorable together. Now, we're going to change baby Edwin. So, his name is Edwin. That was what I had named him when he was first in my collection. He's Edwin by Bonnie Brown. This kit came out in... No, he's not Edwin by Bonnie Brown. Ah, 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 ah. He's Ellie Sue by Bonnie Brown. <laughs> I named him Edwin. That's his kid name. <laughs> and I don't know how I came up with that name, but it just worked. But he came out in 2015. So that's how old the kit is. Um, the reason that I don't make many of this kit, like I do a lot of her other sculpts, is because the vinyl is very different and um, I just personally have a harder time painting on it. I feel like my paints don't work the same as they do on the other vinyls. So that's why I've not made many of this doll. And when I was um, refreshing up his paint, I was like, oh my God, I remember why I hated painting you. 
Um, and that's why I haven't made more of him. So if I don't enjoy painting the kits, I just don't do them. That's why I don't, you know, take a lot of custom, well, I don't take custom work, but um, that's why I don't. One of the reasons is because sometimes kits are asked to be painted and I just don't like them. I also don't like being directed with my work. I always feel it's just the, you get the natural, you get the best work from an artist that just can flow naturally and work as they want to. So that's why I always just try to pick cute kits to make and sell for you guys. But yeah, that's um, one of the reasons why I don't do customs. So he is so adorable. So happy with how his touch-up paint came out. He used to have pale hands and pale feet because I was going for this particular just born look. And I was like, look, we can't have this just born look with you anymore because we're gonna be taking you out. And then um, Jackie, painted his hair because he had like a penciled he had my version of painted hair that I tried once and um she just went in painted it up and made it so realistic I love it so we're gonna put on this little set here these are child of mine newborn lion shoes that I found at Walmart and then this set is by Gerber we've got little lion mittens with the lion hat in the onesie it's a warm day around here but there's still you know a little chill but it's not really that much so i thought i would put on a little sweater kind of make him look a little more appropriate for the setting and this sweater is by h and m Ugh, it's one of my favorite sweaters remember when i got it it was full price at 19.99 and i don't ever really do that i like to get stuff that you know carter's always has 40 percent off i like to get my stuff on sale if i can and I was like, well, if I'm going to buy that sweater, I better use it a few times because I'm very known to um, use the outfit once and then I list it on my website to sell. But in the past, I, I've always just used the outfit one time and I was like, that sweater, you paid way too much to just use it one time and then not use it again. And I love the sweater so much, it matches a lot of things. So I've actually used it more than once. You just haven't seen it with this baby, but uh, because, you know, he's new back in the collection. But Noah wore it. Look at how cute he looks. So adorable. All right. Let's put on his hand. No. We'll put on his sweater first and then do the hand mittens. And I love how this brown just complements uh, the onesie so much. And I didn't recently buy these. So if you go looking for them, they could possibly be out of stock. Um, I have had this stuff here with me for some time now so and I had bought this set actually before I had started Noah so it's been a while okay so here's your little hand mittens my goodness oh my goodness so cute so I got some new kits in the mail today that are from MacPherson's my friend um purchased them for me they arrived I'm not going to be showing them in the video because I don't want MacPherson's to put two and two together and block my friend because that would be pretty screwed up of them since they've already blocked me from buying with them but yeah they arrived as you guys know i always make authentic kits and sell them but um <clears throat> and if i hadn't i would tell you okay now that edwin is dressed i have this little thing we're gonna open together it's called my squishy little snacks pack i got it at um where did I get it? Five Below. Yes, I got it at Five Below. It is so cute. I saw one on TikTok. So I'm hoping that I get a cute one too. So let's open this up. Ah, my goodness. The little box is adorable. Lots of detail there. Okay. <gasps> what is it? Oh, it wears headphones, whatever it is. Okay, look at that. It's like a little party room in there. That's so cute. Oh my gosh, let's see. Oh, it's taped shut right there. What did we get? Oh, the little marshmallow. Cute. And it is squishy. Pop its little legs out. That's adorable. Oh my gosh, so then it can wear these little headphones. I should have bought two of them. It was a couple weeks ago I bought this one. Ha, oh, how cute! Little cute guy. There he is, this is my little squishy snack. 
All right, well, I hope you guys had fun in this video. Thanks so much for hanging out with us. We'll be back soon. Remember to stay safe, stay positive. Don't give in to those communistic Karens. Just block them and move on. We love you guys so much. Bye.